Hi everyone, this is Country Cuddlebugs Nursery and today I have another box opening from the Ashton Drake's Galleries and I will be opening up Lily Rose. Now when this box arrived to me, it seemed like it was a little bit ripped and there was a hole in the back of the box and even on the back of this box there is a hole in it. So I'm really hoping that this was not an item that was purchased and then returned and if you look at the front of the box it looks like it's been taped so Lily Rose I have to double check on this but I believe she was the very first partial silicone or silicone doll to the Ashton Drake galleries and so um, she is an older doll but because she was the very first I thought it would be a nice doll to have in a collection so I have not opened up the box yet I want you and I to see it together for the first time so let's go ahead and open up the box okay so the first thing I see here Lily Rose comes with a another outfit which I believe is a pajama which is really cute and then she also comes with a blanket So it's pink and it's lined in a green ribbon and then in one of the corners it has a lily and a rose. It has little pearl flowers in there as well. So those look alright. Now let's move on. Well, let me first open up the Certificate of Authenticity and see what it says. So here's a picture of Lily Rose. And I actually, from all of the partial silicones that the Ashton Drake Galleries has, I really love Lily Rose's face. And she just seemed uh, more lifelike to me especially in her picture we'll see now with the actual doll but it says Lily Rose is designed by master doll artist Michelle Fagan and is issued exclusively by the Ashton Drake's galleries so it says Michelle Fagan always enjoyed creating whether it was painting drawing or making small trinkets out of clay she has always enjoyed her dolls she began collecting, marveling at baby dolls that looked so real you could almost see them breathe. So keen was her interest that she began sculpting, sculpting her own dolls for herself. Then with the encouragement of fellow doll artists, she began to share her gift of creativity with the world. All her dolls are created from the heart and express serene and sweet emotions. And although she loves the creative process, bringing joy to her many fans is her greatest pleasure of all. And then it just tells you how to display and care for your Ashton Drake Galleries doll. And so Lily Rose is designed by master doll artist Michelle Fagan and is issued exclusi exclusively by the Ashton Drake's Galleries. Upon the retirement of this issue, no more of the edition of Lily Rose will ever be produced. Once the edition is retired, it will never be reopened. Okay, so it doesn't say anything here about her being the first, but I'm pretty sure I did read it on the website, so I will double check that again. Okay, so now let us take her out of the box. I believe she is 22 inches, which makes her a really nice size. So her silicone feels really nice. 
She has her little slipper there and her foot. Now I just um, purchased Little and Lovely Gabrielle. So if you want to check out her unboxing video, um, you can check that out. I'll post it in the description box below. I'm going to do a more detailed video of her and I will be changing out her body and I also have plans to change out Lily Rose's body. So those will be some upcoming videos that you can look out for. Her legs feel nice and heavy. Okay, so here's her little feet. So far so good. Now with her hands. Just the little tag that says Lily Rose. Lily Rose is an original issue silicone doll created by artist Michelle Fagan. Okay. And I will do a more detailed video on Lily Rose as well. This is just pretty much unboxing her. I had watched quite a few videos on her, so I will be sharing what I learned about her and what I learned from her after looking her over as well. She has a really, really beautiful dress. It is a light yellow, and then it has roses on it, of course, and then she has this really pretty pink ribbon. And there is Lily Rose. I love her face. I think she is so, so pretty. There she is. So she has light blue eyes. I noticed from some box openings that I had seen that some Lily Roses seem to have light blue and then some seem to have dark blue I don't know if that was just me or but she is really really precious I love her mouth how she has that little expression as she's ready to say something let's take her little hairnet off so here's her bonnet let me show you the bonnet first really cute Okay, and she has quite a bit of hair on her. And the one thing that I noticed about her as well, let's see, it is hand rooted. And it doesn't seem very pluggy at all. Like it, it does seem more micro rooted. You really can't see the holes, which is nice. Because what I noticed is a lot of people that purchased Lily Rose said that um, after brushing her that they noticed some of her hair falling out. And I even seen a couple dolls where they just ended up taking out all her hair and she was bald. And she really looked cute as a bald, um, as a bald baby. So I hope to keep her hair but if it gets to the point where it is falling out then at least I know that I'm still really going to like her without hair. Unless, of course, I get her rooted. But she is just precious. I think she is so, so pretty. Okay, guys, well, I'm going to end the video here. I'm going to look her over a little bit more myself. And then, as I said, once I know her limbs and everything about her a little bit better I will do a details video very very soon so I really hope that you enjoyed the video if you did please give it a like share and if you haven't subscribed to my channel I really really hope you do so you take care of yourself guys and I hope to catch you in my next video
Bye-bye.